Hello everyone and welcome back to CMB Extra. Now, PAX East has been going on a whole bunch as of late and I haven't kept up with any of it for a whole bunch of reasons. I've been busy, been doing stuff, and I also haven't been that overly interested. But hey, we actually got something pretty interesting today, just now. Got put up on the Discord server, which you, if you haven't joined, link in the description below, um, to some brand new gameplay that came out. And my gosh, it actually looks good. It actually looks pretty good. The animations are finally good. I know, it's crazy. So let's, uh, we're gonna uh, go through it, talk about a little bit, and I thought that could be a pretty fun experience. So the first thing I noticed is, once again, it is very, very oversaturated. I don't know what's, they've said multiple times that that's not the way it's meant to be, but at some point you can't use the excuse of, oh, it's a faulty capture card. This is the second event, so I'm not sure if this is the uploader oversaturating it, if it's quote-unquote another faulty capture card, or if this is just how the game looks. I, <laughs> we're getting some mixed messages, all right. We're getting some some interesting mixed messages from this uh, company. Uh, one thing, though, the cutscenes themselves looked pretty bad. <laughs> Um, like the shadows on Squidward looked pretty bad. It looked worse than the first gameplay we got, which I thought was interesting. But then you get into the actual bit where like the in-game models are talking to each other and all that type of stuff, and it looks way better. Like the, the shadows, all that type of stuff, it looks pretty fantastic. Yeah, again, it looks kind of oversaturated. Yeah, again, don't know what's going on with all that, but I know it looks way better than it did before. And just the first thing I noticed immediately from seeing the actual gameplay is finally the animations. Like, oh my goodness. The, the jump animation in the first demo we got looked horrendous. It looked like a fan-made game. And now we're finally getting some proper, like, good animation. It still isn't as crisp or as good as, personally, the first game looked animation-wise. Uh, so they clearly have a lot further to go with that. And probably we'll find out once again uh, that this is still a older build of the game than where they're actually up to, most likely. And it's also very frustrating that... We're still only seeing the one level. Uh, it's kind of annoying, um, all that type of stuff. I've also heard rumors from people on the Discord. Yeah, again, I haven't kept up to date with stuff because I'm not overly interested at this point. I'm. Let me rephrase. I am still very interested in this game. I'm still quite excited for this game, but I find uh, people are getting pretty overhyped for it, and I have, I'm worried that people are going to ruin it for themselves by getting overhyped from it, just seeing stuff on Discord of how excited people were getting. And then when this... PAX event wasn't as amazing as people were expecting. Uh, people were quite upset with that. So I'm I'm trying to stay away from that type of stuff. I'm trying to make less videos on it because I don't want to overhype people because I want people to enjoy the game for what it is. And my opinion of the game has always been a lot less than most people. I've never enjoyed the game as much as most people. Um, so my expectations are already extremely measured <laughs> um, as it is. But I don't want to overhype people. That's the main reason. But I'm still really quite frustrated that this is the only gameplay we're getting. Like if I had spent money to go to PAX, I would be very frustrated that firstly, the only I'm fairly sure that only you know, normal people who paid money to go see, they could only play the old demo. This, I believe, was the demo that uh, only a specific group got to play. I think it was probably uh, reporters or whatever. I know, um, haven't looked into it very much, but uh, from what I can remember of people saying stuff on the Discord, that the only people who paid money to go to PAX were still playing the same old demo. I would be so pissed off if I'd spent money to play an old demo of a game, which was already out of date at the previous PAX event. And then I'm just playing the same level type of thing for 13 or whatever minutes. Also, this uh, gameplay doesn't have a timer on it, which is interesting. I believe, how long is it? It's only six minutes, six, uh, oh, it's nearly seven minutes. Um, so pretty, pretty, pretty interesting. But yeah, so the, the main thing I've noticed is the difference in the, of course, animations, which looks way better, facial animation stuff. Also stuff like particle effects look way better than they did before. Um, also heard that there's some rumors that the audio is going to be the same from the previous game, so we'll get, you know, weird sounding Mr. Krabs, which I don't, know, I don't care that much. Uh, it's gonna be fine. But it's pretty interesting that they're doing that. It's a bit of a worry considering that was a PS2 game, so hopefully they have, you know, like the original, they would have to have the original files, the high quality original recordings. That's the only way I believe they could make it work, uh, especially with the, um, 
soundtracks. I believe someone mentioned that the original soundtrack is like mono or something like that, not stereo. Or, I don't know. There's whole stuff that the original gameplay soundtrack isn't as good quality as it would need to be for a release of this capacity and this age type of thing, which and it's, it's a bit of a worry, but I'm sure they know what they're, they're doing. I, I have mentioned before that I have... I don't have the most faith in Purple Lamp Studios or uh, THQ Nordic, just for the sake that THQ Nordic hasn't put out something overly mind-blowing in its history. Uh, a lot of its releases are on the average to above average side. Um, they do some interesting decisions, and of course, doing this, they, you know, doing all the stuff of Nickelodeon, I, of course, appreciate them for doing that, but they haven't won my... Uh, respect or appreciation too much yet we'll see how this game goes and also purple lamp just hasn't done anything of substance for me to be able to be like point at them and say yes this is a quality company that can most definitely achieve amazing results um it's just me being skeptical about the opportunities they can do also a uh, major thing is that you can now do the bungee jumping i believe you couldn't do the bungee jumping in the previous gameplay we got so Obviously, much further in, into development. Still frustrated. This is the only level we're getting to see. I would have liked to see at least um, Bikini Bottom or uh, the Dutchman's Graveyard or something like that, just to show that you know some substantial stuff has happened in this demo. Yeah, again, if I was paying money to go to PAX East, I wouldn't want to just play the same one level of SpongeBob. Like, come on, man. Come on, man. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so that's, that's those are my thoughts on kind of the gameplay we've gotten so far. It looks better. Yeah, again, the saturation stuff is a bit of a worry. The sounds being the same as the pre original game is a bit of a worry. Um, and the fact that we're still only seeing this one area is a bit of a worry. But I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of what you thought of this gameplay and what you thought of PAX as a whole. I'm probably not going to do a video recapping all of it. I might do a video with Riders or with... Um, some other people doing a recap thing maybe on their channel or mine i know uh we'll work that out but i i'll talk about it a little bit more extensively at some point but i don't tend to make pex east all information compiled type of thing um just because yeah again i don't want to overhype people i don't want to be the one getting comments on release day how could you overhype this game for me i'm so disappointed uh, i want to avoid those types of situations as much as possible but yeah that, so that's what gameplay major gameplay i've seen so far um let me know in the comments down below what you thought of it and i'll see you all in the next video bye bye Mwah.